Okay, let's continue. All right. Uh, yes. Yeah, so what were we doing? We had the uh, Zima two. Uh, uh, we had Zima twenty, right? We were trying to figure out how many. If we are missing something, let's see. So what, what does it consist of? Uh, we have one. One three. One three, what else? Uh, seven, right? One three seven. Nine. Nine. Eleven. Eleven. Thirteen. Uh -huh. Seventeen. Nineteen. Seventeen and nineteen. So mm -hmm. it's eight elements as we. Mm -hmm. Why is it? Well, we know that it's eight elements from uh, computing the Euler's function, for example, right? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> yes. Yeah, so it, let's see. It's one, three, seven. Okay. So uh, three. Uh, let's see. So uh, what order does three have? Uh, let's see. Three. Uh, yes. Three uh, to. Uh, Yes, so three to the power of four, that's one, right? Mm -hmm. Three to the power of four is one. So three has order four. Uh, seven, what can we say about seven? Uh, seven is, let's see, 280. Uh, uh -huh. So seven actually, yeah. What what order does seven have? So let's see. It's... I calculated in calculator that everything has in in four power everything is zero. So. Uh huh. And uh, is there anything? Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. so there is anything which is. Zero in power two, because no, I guess classifications. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, the classification applies, right? So we just say, uh, so we just need this. Uh -huh, Z, mod four. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> so every, everything to the power of four is is one, right? Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm, okay. All right, so that means we have this. And uh, yeah, so what subgroups does it have of index two? Uh, let's see, so yes, yeah, so there is the there is the cyclic one that is this, zero and one. There is the cyclic one that's given by one and one. Uh-huh, there is uh there is the non-cyclic one uh, how many let's see so non-cyclic is one zero and one zero and what else so uh -huh. so for example if we want to create number of cyclic subgroups we need to know how many elements of order four are there. Mm -hmm. Of course, we know that it's like uh, four elements of order four, and each subgroup has two own elements of order four. And if we are counting like Z2 times Z2, then each subgroup has two el three elements of order two. And mm -hmm. there is only three elements of order two. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's right. Yes. So it's definitely three subgroups of index two. Mm -hmm. So that means, right. <clears throat> so we definitely have plus and minus one. Maybe it's something non gauis uh, non, non gaua but I think that in the lecture we proved that always go. Mm -hmm. 
Ah, all of the all of them are go. Uh, uh -huh. Both psychoatomic feuds. Mm -hmm. but, but maybe I understand it wrong. Maybe there are subfields. Could be that there are subfields or not go. Uh, because it's not the whole psychoatomic field itself. Right, 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 exactly. Uh-huh. That's right. No, but any but any quadratic uh, any quadratic extension should be glow, right? But where are quadratic extensions? It's extension of some mm. element. What do you mean? We have an extension of z to the power of twenty. And we use a uh, Goliath theorem for it. Mm -hmm. So well, maybe it's not it's not ego because obviously something is wrong. Mm -hmm. Let's see. So so oh yeah, plus one is not. And so we have. One, I have negative one. We have, I think, hmm. But we also must have square root of 10, right? So we have square root of, uh, right, we have square root of, uh, what was it? Uh, minus one divided by two. Actually, do we have? Do we have an extension uh, square root of two? Ah, maybe we don't have square root of two. Yeah, but that's right. We know that for any prime number. Uh, well, it's not uh, actually for any prime number. It might be just- For any odd primes, yeah. Yeah, for any odd prime. Mm. Yeah. So, and we can't draw a picture because 20 is not 24 and not divisible by eight now that's the answer mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yes 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 that's right really uh-huh uh -huh. so that's right so we just have minus one and we have plus minus five mm -hmm. yes yes <clears throat> so then we need to check um right we need to check which of this one, two, up to 12, which of them split uh, in such quadratic extension? Let's see here. So, does two split? Mm. Yes, two splits, right? It's it's one minus i, one plus i. Mm -hmm. You mean splits in some quadratic subextension again? Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, so two splits, but uh, again by the norm consideration, uh, neither of this. Uh, can, uh, well, neither of this can have norm two, right? So- But can uh, it split to like more in our whole ring of integers? It could, it could split more, but uh, it does have to split into quadratic ones also, right? Because we, uh, we need the, uh, uh, Yes, it could split more. It could split like into five different ones, right? For example. Mm -hmm. Split into five different ones. And... <clears throat> But I, I think by norm, again, by norm considerations, right, we would still, uh, 
it still wouldn't work because it has to be at least the, the norm would be too big still so uh, yeah yeah the norm would be too we, big. we can consider some element of our ring of integers and calculated norm for this mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but i think that it's hard okay because mm -hmm. it's some basis and some conjugation then mm -hmm. not, not not obvious can split in some other way uh, I just don't understand how we like use it same thing in case of seven, but okay, maybe I will think about it later. Well, in the case of seven, in the case of seven, oh, you mean like what? When we uh, say something like uh, three is decomposed to product of two things in quadratic case. Mm -hmm. And they are prime in quadratic case, but why they are prime in or in our field, in our ring of integers? Hold. I would see. Yeah, good question. Yeah, I'm not sure. Well, I, I, anyway, I guess we'll have to move on to a different problem at any rate. But this is the way to do it, basically. Okay, uh, thank you. I think I need to go now. Yeah, okay. All right, yeah, I, I guess, I guess we'll continue right. later. Yes, all right. Thank you. Goodbye. Uh -huh.